everyone, welcome. Today we'll talk about the HERE Routing API. It's a powerful tool that helps you create dynamic routing experiences for your location-based applications. In this video, we'll guide you through getting started with the API, show you how to make your first request using Postman, and understand the response you receive. So let's explore this. The HERE Routing API is a RESTful web service that allows you to calculate routes, get estimated travel times, and get turn-by-turn -turn navigation instructions for various modes of transportation, including driving, walking, trucking, public transit, and electric vehicles. It provides a wide range of options and parameters to customize the routing experience, such as traffic conditions, vehicle types, and road restrictions. It's perfect for applications that require optimal route planning, whether for logistics, transportation, or mapping solutions. All right, let's get started with the HERE Routing API. First, you need to sign up for a HERE Platform account to get your API key. We'll start with HERE Routing API page and click on Get Started for free. If you're new to HERE Platform, create a free base plan account Let's see what you get with the free account. Click on Tiered Pricing. Under Location Services, scroll down to Here Routing. Here you can see the monthly transaction tiers and their pricing for different modes of transport. As you can see, the first tier is free. All right, getting back to the registration process, fill in the required information to create the free account or sign in to your existing platform account. First, let's create a project for our routing application. On the HERE platform from the launcher, open the Projects Manager, create a new project, enter a name for this project, and a project ID, which needs to be unique. Optionally, you can add project description and save this. Let's open the project we just created. Under Resources, select Services, and then click link a service. Search for here routing, click link and done. Next, let's create an app and get the API key. From the launcher, we'll go to access manager this time, select the apps tab and click register new app. Add a name for the app. You can add a description and register. You can also go back to Edit App and select a default project for this app. Here we'll select the project we just created. Now the app has access to the routing service we had linked to the project. On the Credentials tab, select API Keys and then Create API Key. You can generate maximum of two API keys for your application. For now, we'll just need one. Let's copy this to our clipboard. And this will be used when we create a Postman request. Let's explore the documentation to understand the API request. We'll start with the here docs site. Under services, you can find here routing. Here you can find detailed information about what the API is, how to get started, concepts, and tutorials. Today, we look at a tutorial on waypoints, which means you're routing from A to B and need to stop at a couple places in between. To make an API request, we'll use Postman. Let's open up Postman and start creating our first request. Let's select New Request, HTTP, select Get, and we'll paste the endpoint from the documentation. All parameters look good, except we still need to add the API key. Let's go to Environments, Globals, and then Add New Variable. I'll name this variable REST API key and add the API key which was saved from the platform account earlier. Let's go back to the routing request. For API key, we select the value as REST API key variable there you go. The request is now ready. 
let's send it. As you can see, we have received a response from the API with detailed information about our route. It has sections of route, arrival time and place, summary, and a polyline. The summary has the estimated duration of travel and length. The polyline can be used to draw the route on the map. Feel free to try out other use cases from Developer Guide, explore the API reference to know what other query parameters and response attributes are available. We also have a demo application that has all the available parameters that you can explore and try. As you select the different parameters such as return attributes, spans, transportation mode, vehicle occupancy, departure time, EV parameters if you're using EV routing, and more. This generates the API request with the values you selected. You can use the map to add route to and from, set waypoints, add avoid polygons, etc. Next, you can add your own API key to run the request right here, or you can copy the request to run it in Postman or any other application of your choice. That's it for this basic tutorial on the HERE routing API. We've covered what it is, how to get started, and how to make your first request using Postman. Remember, there are many more features and options available with this API, so be sure to explore the documentation. Thanks for tuning in, and happy routing.